Pisces, and welcome to your coffee cup reading for the week of June 21st through the 27th, and this is a very general reading. Peace, peace is what I'm feeling here. You have, you know, new opportunities. New opportunities are opening up here. At times, you may feel like there's a still a void. It's You've got an up and down energy, so try to kind of balance it this week. I see peace. For some of you, you may have a truce or a peace treaty with someone or a situation. But creating peace is um, important. I do see a lot of peaceful energies. And, you know, peace is or, you know, that time where everything's kind of peaceful. It doesn't always last long, but so enjoy it as much as you can. Um, I do see that energy here, and that's looking good. I see a lot of energies around you um, as well, too. You could be dealing with a lot of um, people or talking to people you usually don't. I see a Sagittarius energy, Aquarius, Virgo energy. Hmm. I want to say overall I'm seeing... <clears throat> Maybe this is something you've been waiting for or you're worried about money or you're waiting for a paycheck or you're waiting for some kind of, it could be anything. I'm just, you know, it's a general reading, but I have to, um, you know, the next two weeks know that these obstacles or you're experiencing some kind of delays, they, they will favor you, you know, and I've learned that lesson this year and I'm seeing it in a many readings is believe me that any delays have saved me either money or my time and energy and something better came along or whatever. Um, so yeah, I'm seeing that kind of energy here. Um, you are opening up, you got, you know, you got a, a spiritual blessing coming in. This is a new spiritual and emotional path opening up for you. Huh? I want to say you have a yes answer to anything I don't answer in this reading. Someone may have had a question, okay? It's like you're learning um, some either this is like good for school, these are lessons you're learning, or you've learned lessons and you're kind of applying to, um, to them. And this is connected to something personal too, love life and some situations um, in your life here too. It's like some of you is you're very careful what to commit to or goals because it's like things come together. Just say you've been wanting something and then or a job and then all of them these opportunities come together and they kind of clash. But they will work out. Okay, they will work out. They'll, they'll work themselves out from what I'm seeing here. Um so kind of slow it down, let some things fall into pieces, um prioritize in a way and they will work themselves out. I see a lot of new opportunities coming through, too. Um, now, I do see money, um, property, investing in property. This is also, for some of you, this is a good uh, money um, opportunity. Can be a raise, future finances for some of you. There's been some expenses, and you've stretched yourself out. So things are uh, decreasing. Um, but you have an increase coming in too. What I want to say is where, you know, you kind of stretch yourself out with either money or um, with your emotions, okay? Whatever. you Maybe you've been trying to be at two places at the same time. You know what I mean? There's a sense of needing to decrease this, okay? And um, it's just clearing the space for something in the future. Maybe you completed something and now it's like recovery. I don't know how else to explain it. So I'm seeing that kind of energy too. I do see a message coming in, or this could be news. Some of you could be dealing with a child or someone younger than you. It can be like a Sagittarius energy too. Um, maybe you're going to hear a message and then you're going to experience some delays or you're like, oh, I don't know what to do. That kind of energy too. This is a time to stop things, you know, I'm going to say like, Maybe putting some things off, okay? Let's say you your grass is too high. You haven't mowed the lawn, so, you know, it's time to go do that. There is something that needs to be kind of capped, okay? It's like, I see, it's like a faucet dripping, and it's like you need to finally stop the water, otherwise your water bill is going to be high. There is that energy of a rest, um, you know, stopping something that is decaying, um, or set something right, 
you know, stop the bleeding, so to speak. I don't know what it is. I'm just seeing that kind of energy. And this is also where you are, like, self-imposing yourself, um, um, restricting yourself, I want to say. You're, you're kind of imposing on your own self, um, overthinking some things as well. Um, I do see there's some kind of stagnation. It's like you're feeling stuck, but it's like you just kind of need to put a distance between yourself and the situation and then um, then just let things kind of go, um, flow, and um, you, you will, um, you know, it's like kind of going with the flow is going to help that stagnation break. Don't try to push anything, so to speak. Um, I see kind of rebirthing here. Um, this could be... Um, Something being rehashed or somebody's maybe kind of feels like they owe you some kind of redemption. They want to redeem themselves to you. So this could be an upcoming apology in the future. So we're seeing a lot of that energy. There's a rebirthing here as well. Um, don't assess or judge a situation or a person or anything yet because you're not sure. Um, you don't have all the information. So patience is a virtue, I want to say. Um, there's also an energy of, there's a too much, there's an excess here. It's like, um, it's time to kind of do a complete, um, a clearing. Okay. So anything that's like overdone, oh, you know, it's like clearing the home, clearing your desk. Uh, there's a sense of purging and clearing is going to be very important. There can be something that you want to do, or you're thinking something over and you may may take some time to do it though. Okay. It's almost like you may be put in a position of needing to make a decision really quickly. Okay. Now there could be some gossipers or rumors or something you hear, and then you kind of like shut down communications with this person. You stop talking to someone is very important. Is, is something I'm seeing here too. I just feel a little bit of conflict may be happening. There could be some arguments um, that can occur as well. Conflict with others. Um, or you're conflicted which way to go, you know, kind of making a decision. There's just, it could be just too much. Some things are just at the point stacked, not against you, but things will improve. Okay. It's like getting advice if you need help or, you know, trying to make some kind of choice, um, taking a different approach. Um, if there is conflict around you too, it's better to just take the high road, okay? Avoiding, picking and choosing your battles or conflicts is very important as well. Um, I do see a recovery here, um, showing up too. There is something that's telling you to slow down, stop, but you're getting too deep in. And I think I saw this for Scorpio. So very similar energies. There's something that um, either you're not knowing, you know, where you're heading with a group of people or situation. I can say for some, this is a very general reading. There can be a little bit of danger um, around, um, you know what I mean? <sighs> or it's just something tricky. Kind of watch your step. Okay. So, or this could be just something emotional. You could be just going down a rabbit hole somehow. Uh, removing yourself from a situation and proceeding with caution is um, important. It's like just going in a little bit too deep, okay? And this could be like just a conflict or something that could just spiral into something. So um, there is this sense of just separating from anything that's negative, thinking things through, getting the rest you need, and just kind of, um, um, you know, silent contemplation is the best I can explain here. Watch your health and well-being. Um, because if you don't rest, your immune system can be compromised. You know what I mean? So it's, there's a need to rest. I have to say that too. Okay. And, you know, slowing down some things. Okay. This could be also a decision or, um, words have power too. Okay. It's like the, um, if you're frustrated in that, be careful what you do say. You know what I mean? Don't speak out of emotions or frustrations. Kind of just, um, that kind of energy. So, yeah. But I think there's going to be some kind of decisions that maybe some of you are going to have to make. Kind of trust issues. Sometimes we need to just have more trust in ourselves, too. Um, so, you know, that's the best I can say for a general reading. So creating that peace is very important. And being conflicted. 
about which way to go. <laughs> you have to do what's right for you, though, okay? All right, Pisces, that was your reading for the week of June 21st through the 27th. I hope you have a wonderful week, and I'll catch you back next week for your next Coffee Cup reading. Until then, all the best, and bye for now.